what up big herc 916 positivity motivation never settle for average hey man go to bigherc916.com pick you up some merch represent and wash your ass now i know by now most of you should have heard about the chinese spy balloon that was shot down over the atlantic and according to fox news while the balloon was off the coast of south carolina it was shot down by u.s military fighter jets on saturday afternoon um according to the fox news source a senior u.s military official said the f-22 was used to bring down the balloon at 58,000 feet adding that a single a9x missile was fired a senior defense official said during a Thursday afternoon briefing that the U.S. government is confident the surveillance balloon is from the People's Republic of China. When asked about the balloon on Saturday by reporter, Biden said, we're going to take care of it. China maintains spy balloon is civilian, claims some in U.S. have hyped it up to attack and smear China. Man, I tell you, man, they think we're a bunch of dummies out here, man. I mean, you really think that a balloon coming from China with all the technology, all the ability to track cell phones, satellites, radars, that they didn't see the balloon before it came to the United States and entered into our, our borders? And, and China thinks that we're that stupid that it was a, oh, what's this, a civilian balloon? I mean, these people have been doing surveillance on us. I mean, just open up TikTok. <laughs> They're watching everything we're doing. So how, how lame does it sound to say that, oh, it's a civilian balloon and you're trying to smear us and, oh my God, we don't know what's going on with that thing floating over some of your military installations and snapping photos and sending back images and blah, blah, blah. It's, it's, a, it's a cat and mouse game being played on a global scale. And the American public, in my opinion, they just keep looking at us as like, how, how, how these guys will fall for anything. We can tell them whatever and they're going to believe it because we control the news media. Um, during the pr briefing on Thursday, the defense official said the balloon had been previously spotted over Montana where the decision was made to not shoot it down because of potential risk. So Montana has a lot of uh, military stuff across that particular state. And of course it was going to go across Montana to get a surveillance of the, the, the land. <laughs> I mean, what, we're just going to let them take photos and videos of everything and do do do. Oh, yeah, what is that? Oh, yeah. I mean, they, <laughs> take, they got robots right now that are doing surveillance at places that are unmanned. So we don't have the ability with all the drones to know that before this thing even gets close, why not just get rid of it? Sometimes I wonder what people are really think. And when people read this, uh, uh, this news report and they are like, wow, man, they shot it down. Yeah, America, you did it. Really? Really, man? Is this a, is this a, a pre-2024 uh, election to say strong America we shot down a balloon get the hell out of here man it's a joke man <laughs> a balloon that's somehow broke its airstream and it floated out of where it was supposed to go and oh we didn't know come on man y'all could do better than that we're not that stupid American people are smarter than you think 
We might not have a loud voice for those of us who are in the know, but I have conversations with a lot of people every every week, and I know that they're not going for the old uh, hoodwink. We've been hoodwinked long enough. <laughs> I mean, you, you can keep telling yourself that we believe it, but I mean, I know there's a lot more smarter people out there that see that this is a lot of bullshit. You guys tell me what you think. Uh, how realistic is it that this balloon made it into our atmosphere undetected was able to gather surveillance video electronically transmit it back to China and we just were like oh we're cool with that keep it 100 man holler at me man leave a comment subscribe to the channel big Herc 916 Hello, my name is Big Herc 916 and I'm with the Wash Your Ass Committee and I'm traveling across America helping people wash their ass and get their booty holes clean. And I have with me here today, Wash Your Ass Soap. And this one in particular is Butt Naked Scrub, but I also have Festival, Oatmeal Milk and Honey, Jamaican Me Crazy, um, Monkey Farts, and all these scents smell very good. They will help cleanse your body of funk and also make you feel better about yourself so if you can go to bigkirk916.com you can pick you up a bar and my goal is to help america combat funk Lockdown's over. Get your yard time in. Exclusively at FreshOutSeries.com. Stop walking around with a crusty butt, smelly ball sack, and a funky hoo-ha. Big Herc said wash that ass. Pick you up a t-shirt at FreshOutSeries.com.